Welcome back. Again, my name is Jeff Stoffel, a Partner Technology Strategist with the Microsoft TS2 team. In today's session, I will show you how to utilize the Office 365 Admin Center to request delegated admin rights so that you can administer your customer's environment. In addition, we'll walk through how to have your customers designate you as Partner of Record, also known as POR. For those of you that are not familiar with the Partner Admin Center, I suggest you start with the first in the series, an overview of the Partner Admin Center. Let's get started. First thing you will want to do once you are in the Admin Center is click on the Partner tab. You should now be in the Partner Admin Center. On the left side you will see a few choices. Today we are going to select Build Your Business. In this session we are going to focus on the Delegate Admin Offer. Delegated administration allows you to have full administrative access to your customers' services and subscriptions. This means you can perform administrative tasks on behalf of your customers, including setting up mailboxes, adding or removing users and groups, data migrations, and submitting service requests to Microsoft customer service and support. Before you can start administering your customer's account, your customer must authorize you as a delegated administrator. We are going to walk through how to get this authorization. Click on the Delegate Admin Offer. From here, you simply copy the text, including the URL, into a message that you will provide to your customer. When the customer clicks on the link listed in the message, they will be prompted to approve your delegated administration invitation. Once they approve, you are all set and ready to manage your customer's environment. Now let's talk about Partner of Record, also referred to as POR. If your customer subscribed to Office 365, Following a link you generated from the Partner Admin Center, you will automatically be listed as your customer's Partner of Record. As we discussed in the previous session, being listed as your customer's Partner of Record is key for a number of reasons. You must be registered as your customer's Partner of Record in order to earn any applicable advisor fees on the subscription. In addition, the Partner of Record is utilized to determine what partner should receive communications regarding your customer's subscription, such as renewal notices. If, however, your customer did not sign up following a link that you generated and did not enter your MPN Partner ID for Partner of Record when signing up, you can still walk your customer through the process in order to be listed as Partner of Record. Now let's walk through the process of assigning a Partner of Record from the customer's view. This is a process that must be done by the customer even if you have delegated admin rights. When the customer logs in with their Office 365 admin account, they will need to click on the Admin drop-down and select Office 365. From this page, the customer has many options to manage their subscription. They will need to click on Licensing in order to enter the Partner of Record information. From the Licensing page, your customer will need to click on the subscription they wish to add you as Partner of Record. From the Subscription Details page, the customer can select Add under Partner Information. At this point, the customer can enter your Microsoft Partner ID and click OK. The system will check that a valid Partner ID has been entered. Going forward, you will earn any applicable advisor fees on the subscription. In addition, you will receive communications regarding your customer subscription, such as renewal notices. That's it for today. Please join us for the next session and have a great day.